This is Meet Your Maker, and our goal is to raid the hardest bases in the game while speedrunning. Son of a bitch. Welcome mates, I'm Bloodthirsty Lord by Incoming Lordy, and in this video, we will highlight one of the most unique consumables in Meet Your Maker, and see if it's possible to speedrun impossible base raids with movement. This is gonna be fun, so bring out your chalice and stay hydrated. Another day of Meet Your Maker. Oh, a couple kills, let's see what's about. Let's go to a kill feed and see how many. 92 kills, being a mastered prestige 10 base. Not too shabby at all. And the hardware or consumable in the game that I was talking about is Spike Drive. This increases movement speed by a crap ton and creates some crazy movement overall when it comes down to your raids, allowing you to speed run really, really well. And pretty much using the same custodian build that we had last time in this OP build video right over here. And now let's jump into some raids on Brutal Difficulty and have some fun. So let's get into this. The first thing I want to do is straight away I'm into this raid is double check this base because this base looks kind of interesting. There's a couple of spots to go to. It goes down. There's some enforcers here. What I can do, instead of killing them, I can put a pod down if I want to, just to get some information. So put a Phoenix pod there. And then use our spy drive and gain movement speed for a bit of a duration. And you can see how good this is. It is crazy how quick it can be. Now we're out of movement speed. It's a bit of a jolt of energy. Let's get this. And then go there. I'm out of this base. See you later. And we're going to activate it again. Run out. And I'm out. See you later. Finishing the base in mere seconds. That's the goal behind this build. You can speed run many bases easily. Very, very interesting. And that's a brutal base, zero deaths. And this is a good way to actually increase your rank. Because every time you survive a base and actually don't die, you get plus 200 towards your rank, making it very easy to climb to masters or other ranks if you desire. Evolve! We've got a chap in outpost, mountain city, let's jump into it. Usually, the reason why I put the pod down initially is just in case I die, I get information. So let's place that down, switch to a spy drive, have it ready to use when we need it. And I feel like now would be a good time, depending on if the flame activated or not. Go past. Please let me go past. Thank you. Thank you. This base is annoying as hell. Yeah, this base is crazy annoying. But we'll make use of this. Jump up. I don't get killed here. Perfect. Did it start again? Can we speed run this? I hope for the best. Let's go through. Speed run. Oh, I'm going the wrong way. No! Oh, I should have put a pod there if I had another one. I think I used it at the start. Unfortunate. Okay, it looks like we can speed run inside of it. I'm going to do it no matter what. Oh my god, I am stuck. Okay, this has been the worst base speedrun. We actually have to play well calculated here. It literally counter speedrunners for this choke point here. Oh my god, no, 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 no. You cannot accept this. Don't just kill the trap in the back. Move, little guy. I'm sorry, I had to kill you. Nah, I can't even go through. It's near impossible. Okay, we can't speedrun this. We actually can't. Just the major of delay here is insane. Headshot. Block that. Go for the shots. Get the shot. Oh, I'm breaking all his armor. I'm undressing the guy. God. That was going to be very bad. Get back up. Dodge all that. Then go in. Block that because you have to dodge that damage. There is a tether there as well, pulling us up. Oh, there's going to be a second one. This is a crazy delay base. Really well done. Another one above. Got to wait it out. Got to wait it out. Push in. Destroy that. Get this. Safe. Okay, that's getting better. That's getting better. We've got a couple more uh, stuff here. Activate that. Push through. Oh my god, where'd they come from? Wait, was he there the whole time or did he drop from above? Oh, from above. Oh, Phoenix spot though. So I'm kind of good here. I'm dead. <laughs> yeah, this base is really well done. Well thought base. Very well thought. Kill each other. Yes. Perfect. Well done. Because their hits go through each other as well. My spy drive this to do damage. 
Oh my god, it got me still. Because you can't use the consumable and actually move at the same time. Compared to like Arc Barrier. This is maybe when switching out to a ranged weapon would be much more beneficial here. Oh my god, I'm losing my mind. I'm going to lose it. This base is insane. What a choke point. Absolutely what a choke point. And I can't push it because of the armored units. Like if I try it, like this. It's near impossible. It's like I force myself to go through it all. This is the best I can do. Then pod this. I'm dead. <laughs> that was a waste, but okay. Not too shabby. I might clear this whole area. Nice. There's another trap there as well. And those bolters above there. This base, man. What a kill box. Not the sand one, to say the least. But it still works identically the same. I turned off there. They nearly pulled us. Dodge that. Well done, well done. Keep burning them. Make them toasty for us. <laughs> this is like the worst based encounter for a speedrun video. I can tell you that. We had an idea and then it's just falling apart because of this base. Oh, I thought it was going to jump from above. Backstab. Nice work. Destroy that. There's still a trap above or something. Yeah. From before. Because we didn't clear it. That's right. Dodge that. I'm full concentrating here. I'm not losing to this base. Not again. I will not accept. And we're done. About time. Oh my god. About time. Try to speedrun this base. Nearly impossible. So many choke points. Well done on that actual champion base. That was brutal and ingenious. I'll give that. That's for sure. Really well done. You have to play slow and you have to use range. Oh, I had too many deaths. No, I'm going to lose points. Doesn't matter. We'll make it the next run. We'll make it the next run. Interesting. Where does this go? I'm not sure, but I hear a tomb. And I'll take all the blue from that. Is there any more tombs? Thank you. Got them all. Follow this road. Went up that pavement towards the base. Let's see what ends up happening here. This looks like a kill switch base. I can tell you straight away. I know bases really well. This is kill switch. Which I have arc barrier and I can put a pod down instantaneously. And it should be alright. I should have sped run it, but I completely forgot about it. I was too focused from the last game. So we're gonna do it. Press this. Press that. Oh shit. Speed run! Speed run! Speed run! Oh my god! What is that? This base is insane. Self-destruct plus second wave? So one self-destruct on this, all them self-destruct. And he had kill switch, I believe. Oh, I wish I could see. But look, guess what? I'm back. I'm safe. They all blow up. and But I'm safe here. Oh my god. Yeah, kill switch. So kill switch into these walls here with self-destruct. That is insane to me with normal walls as well. Okay, there's some normal traps. Okay, someone survives. Self-destruct. Oh my god. That was so close. So close. Did it chain the whole way? It looked like it chained the whole way. The self-destruct, except for that one trap. Oh, here's a dupe. Let's keep that in mind. Got it. Self-destruct. As you see. There we go. Dodged easily. Crazy stuff. Let me just dip out of here. Let's just dip. What a base. That is crazy. Absolutely crazy. I want you that ingenious. I like that. But one death only. And honestly, no issue. Evolve! Another champion base. Oh no. It's gonna be fun. Got a couple areas here. A whole bunch of enforcers on the left. A cube on the right. Makes me think that is a loot room. Definitely is. Can't even get in without a guaranteed death. Actually, I can. I definitely can. Well done. Thank you. Very easy. 
Usually you should die from this, but I ain't gonna die to this. I can tell you that. It's got the pyramid design deco pack. I love these builds. They look crazy. I can backstab everything. What a flank. What a flank. Dodge that, just in case. I don't wanna die. Get that kill. Block that. Destroy this. There's another gold mine over here. I'll take it. Thank you. Give me all that loot. A juicy, juicy loot. And now the base. I gotta get a good look at this. It's the best way to look at this. It looks nuts. Yeah, that looks great. I love this deco pack, the way it all comes together as well. It looks insane. But let's activate a speed run and let's go for it. Go through the base. Give me the loot. Self destruct. Oh no! No! I didn't even see it. It wasn't even a self destruct. I'm so conditioned from the last base. It was actually the explosives. But we, now we know we can just speed run this. I could definitely just speed run here. Got it. Nice and easy. What? That's a thing? Did I go the wrong way? Is that what happened? I'm gonna place this down here. S supercharge. I'll move this speed here. Dodge that. Go back up here. Dodge that. Oh my god. Close. Very, very close. Oh my god. Very nice. I'm gonna give that artistic. I like the way it's designed. One death only, and also getting crazy rank points as well. Level 27, not too shabby. Let's evolve this, and give me the juiciness. I need the juiciness. I need all the currency I can get in this game. There we go. Another base over here. I see a grenade trap at the very start. Very interested to have that at the start. Got that. Usually the benefit of speedrunning is that you can get gem mats really quickly. So that's the goal that you want to do. If you're not speedrunning, you want to hit the traps in order to get XP and also other benefits. Which are also very useful. Just for general uh, quality of life for the game. So, but we can speedrun this. Should be too hard. Nice. Well done. I could have lunged there. Wouldn't let me. Keep going, keep going. Speed run! I'm going the wrong way, aren't I? Oh no. Wait, where is it? I'm not tripping out, it's over here. It's harm set over here. I might get flanked on. Destroy that. Keep going, keep going. I have no more speedrun strats. Oh my speedrunning juice is gone. It's like you're playing Octane from Apex Legends. Ah oh, shit. Well done. Well done. Good spot. I don't know if I was there on second wave or initially then I just bypassed it. We got this, mates. We got this. Oh my god. Nice block. That was a perfect block right there. What's that trap? Main area. Get me out. I'm free. Perfect. There we go. Escaped. Very, very nice. Give that fun. Zero deaths. Love to see that. 200 points towards my rank. Love it. Evolve! And another chap in outpost. Prestige 10. As you see from the icon right there. Very interesting. SOS. Is this going to be that difficult? Oh my god. I can't wait for it. Let's go put a Phoenix Pod right over here first. I'm going to try a speed run. And see what ends up occurring here. Because that's the most important part. Sorry, buddy. I had to kill you. It was my accident. It was my accident. I swear. That stops speed running. Okay, now we need to wait for a second. Can I back as well? Gotta watch out for that. Hologram over here. Can I get that in time? I destroyed one of them, at least. That is bad. Block it. No one flanking. 
I might have to use another speed run strat or keep it for after. I might keep it for after on the way out. Because the gym mat's right here. Activate that. Activate this. And run as quickly as I can. Oh my god. No! Burning hot! It has burning hot! No! That is so unfortunate. Okay, now we don't need to use our Phoenix Pot on the way in. It's just the way out. Oh, uh, they all have burning hot. All of them. So I have to time it all perfectly. Get out of battle, 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 battle. Oh my god. Pushing through, pushing through. Oh my god, burning hot squashed me. You know what? Burning pistons just as a standard thing is actually crazy. Because they have it so instantaneously, you cannot really react to it. Okay, it's stacking on deaths now. Oh my god, we're stacking on deaths. Nice. Good work. Destroy that. Block that for sure. Oh, it's got armor. They got hit by the actual thing. Broke's guard. Perfect. Give me the parts. Thank you. It's got double. They re they don't just go once, they go twice. Get away for the timer. Nice. Push through here. Dodge that. You push through. Hit that. That is unfortunate. Block that. It's alright though. Nearly towards the gem mat. Right next to us. Okay, I'm gonna activate Phoenix Spot straight away. Then stim. Then bypass everything I can. Very nice. I'm gonna hide in this nook. It's safe. Perfect. Well done, well done. Wait for this. Go burning hot. You have to actually wait for the redness to go off. If you don't, you're gonna die. Perfect. That might be a trap. Just tomb. Is tomb safe? Of course I had to go for the tomb. I just had to. Luckily I didn't die. Nice work. Keep it up. Keep it up. I'm going to break the instant. And now get me out of here. Get me out of here. Absolutely out of here. Perfect. SOS. How devastating. I can't believe it. Nearly got me killed. Absolutely got me killed. Multiple times, actually. That was crazy. What a base. What a final base. Ingenious, for sure. Great design. Great design. And that was our time speedrunning raid bases in Meet Your Maker with the Spike Drive. But, mate, tell me your opinions and thoughts in the comment section down below. I'd love to know. Also, mates, we have live streams on Twitch, so make sure to visit that in the description below to check out our next live stream when we do live stream Meet Your Maker and other games in the future. As always, mates, it's a pleasure to have you guys on the channel. As we go through this, and I'll catch you, mates, next time. Bye. Road to 200k subscribers. Let's get it, mates.